ignore that. I just put water on myself because I'm a dingus. It's fine. It's just water. If you guys can tell, I am a little sick right now. I am a little backed up. Love it. Winter is great. This is just another reason I love winter. But that's okay. We're moving on. Not focusing on the negative. I feel like I'm at the lowest point of my sickness, so hopefully I'm about to get better. I have a very exciting video for you today. We are doing a review of the Bar Bella box. You guys, this is so exciting for me because if you guys like followed me like way back when, like I'm talking the OGest of G. I actually used to subscribe to this exact box. And so when Barbella Box reached out to me and they wanted to send me one to do a review, I was like, hell yes. It's so crazy how like life works and I'm just so grateful. A year ago, I was probably posting on my IG page about how cool this was and stuff. But actually the reason that I stopped subscribing to them was because if you guys know, like, know my backstory a little bit, I was working at an engineering firm. I realized that wasn't really my passion. I left that job. When I left that job, I obviously, it was a drastic pay cut. And so I just couldn't afford things like subscription boxes. It was just one of those things that had to go. Finances like first world problems and being so dramatic that's the only reason I unsubscribed to it it wasn't because this wasn't the greatest thing ever I actually loved it and actually I get a lot of comments on a lot of the things that I actually got from Barbella box which I will show you I get a lot of comments on these joggers that I wear a lot I'll pop up some pictures for you guys these actually came from Barbella box they have the Barbella box logo right there. I've definitely like gotten a lot of good things from Barbella box. I feel like a lot of subscription boxes give you a lot of stuff that you don't really need or don't really use but honestly like everything that I got in the boxes when I used to subscribe to them was super useful or like unique or new. I loved it. But today like I said they reached out to me and sent me this box to review for you guys so let's just dive right into it. This is the November box. I have no idea what's inside, but I'm super excited to find out. Before I open it, I guess I didn't say. Basically, what Barbella Box is, is a monthly subscription box for females that has a bunch of fitness-related stuff. Sometimes you get leggings, sometimes you get sports bras and clothes, food items occasionally. I know that I got, like, almond butter and, like, snack packs, and then a lot of fitness items, you know, um, foam rollers jump ropes, things to help you at the gym, all sorts of crazy cool and useful things. Like the value in this box is insane in my opinion. Like they give you so much stuff, like it's so worth it. I'm not sure what the price is on this, but I will look it up and like put it down below, link it or something. Now time to open it, so excited. Okay. So they always give you a little list and description of all of the items in the box. I don't like to read the items i like to just dive in and see what it is but i do keep this so that i can reference it later and then they also usually have like coupons and discount codes so it looks like here we've got the green chef the meal kit made for every kind of lifestyle the five dollar gift card that's pretty cool hypergo full body wipes another promo code for looks like body wipes for when oh it looks like they actually have them in here so you get a promo code for the product and you actually get to try the product. So these are fitness wipes for the face and body. I think these are for when, like after the gym, you get really sweaty, you're feeling really gross, maybe you don't have time for a shower, or maybe you just wanna kinda clean off, whatever, without fully doing the whole thing. You got these body wipes. I used to take makeup wipes and just do that on my body anyway, so this is definitely a step above that. Yeah, so it's like a quick little shower in a wipe. I always want to clean at least my face because, you know, your pores open up when you sweat and your dirt and grime and the gym is just gross. Like We all know the gym is gross, okay? So I always make sure I clean my face just to prevent breakouts or anything like that. That's super important for me. So the fact that these are good for your face and body, ideal. We've got some socks. Freaking love socks, especially like, what do you call it, ankle socks? socks and I like the socks that like show oh god they're so cute 
they've got a little barbell on them oh, socks are so fun next Ooh, looks like a sports bra oh my gosh yes dude we've got a sports bra it's kind of like one of those sports bra top things let's see crossover crop bra from day day active work d-a-e yeah you could wear this underneath something or you could wear it alone I will try this on at the end when we are done going through the box, but I really like the color. I'm very excited. I also like that these these go together. That's just a really nice detail. What is in there? Ooh. So it looks like from the little card here, this is a sweat mobility mat. So it's like a lightweight yoga mat that folds flat so that you don't have to carry around a big yoga mat. This you could fit in like your backpack, your gym bag. I really like that. So it's like the same size of a yoga mat, if you can tell. It says sweat on it, but it's much thinner. Probably not intended for like long yoga, but it's really good for like taking with you because it does fold up. So if you just like need a quick stretch or take this with you if you like travel a lot. I like the material of it too. It's like you can tell it's very wicking. I like the color too. Blue is my favorite color. I'm always down to try new things. Oh, hells yeah. You know your girl loves scrunchies. It's got even like little bow type things on the end. I fucking love a good scrunchie. I wonder if there's anything particular about it. It's an athletic scrunchie, okay? I was gonna say because the material feels like not like a cloth material, but like spandexy, like it's sweat wicking. Made with a stretchy spandex material that is 100% washable. Oh, and the bow is removable so you can untie it whenever you want. Yeah, because I don't know if I'd always, oh, Oh, okay, it is removable. So if you don't want the bow, you can just leave it in the scrunchie. I like that because honestly, I probably wouldn't want the bow. That's just me. I feel like putting a scrunchie in my hair already makes me look like I'm younger, like I'm 12, or at least it makes me feel that way. So having the bow would be like extra. But I really like this scrunchie. I like that it's sweat wicking. It feels really tight too. A lot of my scrunchies, you can tell, sort of give a lot and stretch out. This feels hot. And then last but not least, there is usually always a food or drink item. And because you know it's the season, we have got a pumpkin spice, can't even talk, a pumpkin spice draft latte. I have heard of this brand and I've seen it before, but I've never actually tried it. I might just open it up right now because why not? Do I just open it or do I take off this thing on top? I feel like I just open it. Yeah, okay. Nope, that didn't work. I fucked up, guys. But it tastes good. I think I am supposed to take this thing off. I don't know. Confirmed. I am supposed to take the top thing off. That tastes really good, actually. It's like not super sweet. It's super foamy. But yeah, it does taste like pumpkin spice. Not like Starbucks punch you in the face sweet pumpkin spice. Like, oh, hey, I taste like fall. I'm really impressed with this actually. Normally I don't like pre-made coffee drinks. This is good. Now time to, I guess, let me try on the top real quick. So this is the top. I like it. I'm unsure if this cut is like the most flattering on me. I do like how it's really cinching in the waist right here without digging into your skin and giving you like folds. I love, love, love the color. This is such a pretty, pretty, pretty color. I have the removable pads in right now. I normally take removable pads out, so I'm gonna do that and see what it looks like with them out. I actually like that a little bit better. I'm still unsure of this particular cut if it's the most flattering on me but like it's really really nice material like really good quality if you guys have ever heard of balance athletica which if you follow me at all you probably have because i love them they're my favorite active wear ever it's a very similar like quality material so really really good stuff another note is i'm always really unsure when I do subscription boxes. So how the subscription box works is you give them your sizes, right? So I wear a small in leggings. You know, I wear a small in just about everything. But what's hard for me is buying sports bras and tops because sometimes I'm a small and sometimes I'm a medium because of my bigger chest. 
and so I find that sometimes I like the way a medium fits and the small sometimes like is too tight so I'm always hesitant with subscriptions and things like that when you have to give them your size because you know different brands fit differently but I will say I did tell them that I was a medium just to be safe I'd rather have it be too big than too small and this actually fits really well so that I am impressed with and then oh my gosh we're gonna get a whole outfit going because these socks match and they kind of match my shorts too got a whole pink maroon outfit going on ooh 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 ooh, ooh. swag I like this <laughs> it's like they knew what shorts I was gonna be wearing today let me show you the whole outfit okay it's on my oh that's my mirror it's so dirty don't judge me there it is guys the whole outfit you know kind of looking at it again I kind of do like the top this whole outfit is just a vibe okay moving on now we've also got this scrunchie might as well try out because we're here you know oh I should probably take this off huh and then I need scissors oh, I'm not gonna do it because I'm lazy love a good scrunchie the tag kind of all up in there but I don't even care whip my hair back in boy that ponytail ain't going nowhere this is a stellar freaking box. I'm super excited to try this out. All right, guys, that is it for this little review. Overall, I would say nine out of 10. And that's just because usually the activewear items that, I, that you get in it are either a hit or a miss. Like this is a big maybe for me, but like those uh, joggers that I have are like my favorite pair of joggers that I own. They make my butt look so good. But overall, the quality is always great. You get to like explore new brands and try out new things. The price point of it is very much worth it. But, like you get a lot of good quality stuff. Like they're not just giving you one good item. You get a whole bunch of cool things. So I really think that the subscription box is worth it. I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna go, I'm sick so I'm not gonna go to the gym but I probably should stretch. Maybe I should do like some mobility stuff. That's exactly what I need right now. All right, see you guys later.